everyone, this is Mallory Carlo with Dallas Sports Fanatic right here at Dr. Pepper Bar Park where Dirk's Heroes Training Camp is taking place, getting prepared for tomorrow's celebrity baseball game. Uh, to me, it's, uh, it's a family event. It was created for that. It was created for, for kids as well as adults. Obviously, the baseball is, is fun here and there, and there's some good hits, some good catches, but it's, it's, it's the, the whole show around, you know, whether it's our dancers or uh, the maniacs are coming out or certain games in uh, between innings. It's, uh, uh, we got the, one of the biggest fireworks that I've ever seen there all the, after the game always. So uh, it's about having fun for, uh, for the whole family and um, also combined with, uh, with a little bit of bad baseball. He was asked if hosting a celebrity baseball game would still be a possibility even after retirement. He had a very interesting answer to that. Oh, that's a loaded question. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see, see what you did there. Let's see what you did there. Well, first of all, I'm not 100% sure I'll retire this year, so uh, I kind of leave that open. But I definitely want to do some fundraisers, uh, keep doing a fundraiser for, um, for my foundation. Uh, it's been a great work in this community. Um, but, you know, as you know, we also started the tennis thing uh, every September. This is the third year running we're doing it. So I'm not sure if I keep both going at the same time. Probably not. Um, so I don't think that decision has been made, but uh, there's plenty of, of guys now, I think, that, that could take this game over if they wanted to. Uh, but obviously that's, that's, not, uh, that's not my decision. During Dirk's press conference, he made the comment that Dallas Mavericks guard Kyle Collingsworth was the main one talking trash, saying tomorrow he was going to come out and dominate on the field. Uh, Kyle Collingsworth has been talking some smack a little bit. Uh, he says he played a little bit of baseball growing up in, in Utah. Uh, he says he's a multi-sport athlete. I highly doubt it. Uh, He's not really a one sport athlete. Really. <laughs> but you know, that's my guy. He said that he's a good baseball player, so he'll he'll try to go up there and swing it hard. Kyle, if tomorrow's game goes well, could you see yourself pursuing a career in baseball instead? Oh for sure. No, I mean I batted today, I don't think it'd turn out too great as far as batting goes, but you know, I used to play as a kid. And my dad was a big uh, big time baseball player. So it's fun, it'll be fun tomorrow to get out and play and just a new environment and a new sport. Now, what advice do you have for some of the players who have never stepped inside a batting box before? Just let it rip. Don't overthink it. Just put, you know, let it rip. Just give it your best shot. I think overthinking it is when the ball goes right by you and you just don't know what to do. Now, as far as the game tomorrow, what does it mean to actually be out here and having the opportunity to play? I mean, it's pretty cool, especially you know with Dirk, what he's put together and his crew and what it stands for. It's cool to be a part of and. You know, just to participate in something like this. Also on hand at batting practice was Dallas Mavericks rookie point guard Dennis Smith Jr. He was asked his thoughts on the NBA draft. So a couple of the guys in the draft I played against them and played with them. So we got a number five pick. I believe that we're going to do a good job of getting somebody good for our franchise. I'm looking forward to it. This has been Mallory Carlo with Dallas Sports Fanatic right here at Dr. Pepper Ballpark. Well, I'll catch you tomorrow at 6.30.